एवरी वन क्यों डरे जिंदगी में क्या होगा कुछ ना होगा तो तजुर्बा होगा दीज ब्यूटिफुल लाइन्स हैव बिन पेंट बाई माई गेस्ट ऑफ द डे मिस्टर जावेद अख्तर सर टूडे इज फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन फॉर यू सिंस द डिस्कशन ऑफ द डे इज अबाउट पोएट्री वॉट टाइप ऑफ पोएम्स डिड यू रीड वेन यू वेर चाइल्ड नो आई थिंक एट सम स्टेज ऑफ योर लाइफ एंड पर्टिकुलर वन यूर स्टार्टिंग यू शुड नॉट बी वेरी फसी एंड चूज ही एंड ऑल काइंड ऑफ लिटरेचर शुड बी कंज्यूम एंड रेड आई ऑलवेज एडवाइज यंग पीपल नॉट टू रीड ओनली क्लासिक्स but read some light literature also on one hand read say writers like uh, tolstoy or balzac or uh, alberto moravio and zola and on the other side read paperbacks read uh, dennis robbins and james hadley chase also because you know uh, if you take serious literature classic literature uh, big writers then uh, at a very young age then it can there is a possibility that it may dry you up so you have been the co-writer of the most iconic bollywood film shole and one of the most iconic character from the uh, film is gabbar singh so how did you think about and write the character and his iconic dialogue yes you know uh, what one had thought while writing the dialogue of the film of uh, this particular character that what will make this character interesting is uh, unpredictability you would you should not be able to guess that whether in the next line he'll scream or whisper whether he'll threaten or crack a joke uh, so that unpredictability makes him fascinating and even more dangerous as a matter of fact and uh, he had to stand out so i gave a slightly different dialect to him slightly it was not pure avadhi but uh, a touch of avadhi so that makes him stand out and sound different from rest of the characters of the film and uh, i'm happy that he is appreciated so much that after so many years somebody who was not even born when the film was released is asking me about it so we often see bollywood celebrities not uh putting their opinions on public spaces uh as they fear that this might affect on their career but you have been courageous enough to talk openly about politics in the country so what made you brave enough to speak about politics on a public pla- platform being a person from the industry first of all in democracy i mean nobody no citizen is totally a political as long as you cast your vote to your political and uh, i have never felt that i am being very brave you know, i have because i mean this is my right as a citizen of the country uh, and uh, if i feel something has to be said i say it that's about all and um, yeah sometimes there is some controversy some people troll me some people send me messages and so on and a couple of time police has given me protection also so you have said jis kavita ke liye mujhe paise milte hain mujhe wo kavita yaad nahi rehti hai can you elaborate the statement and what do you exactly mean by this there are two kind of writing one is commissioned uh i'm uh, given a script i read that or narrated that is script to me i have i know that what is the situation what are the characters what is the ethos of this film what is the intellectual level what kind of language they have used in the dialogue and so on and uh, then more often than not not only that the situation is given to me they also give a tune so one has to write for this situation to that tune so this is a kind of a work but no kind of work is uh, uh a kind of a block for good work so yes you can write very good songs and you try your best to write within those circumstances and conditions and uh, but uh, that is for others that has not come from the depth of your heart uh, on the other hand when i write my own poetry i choose choose the meter i choose the subject i choose the theme and so on and so forth so that i know that i'll have to recite again and again uh, uh, nobody is going to sing it now on the other hand 
when I write that song and I give it to them, so I know that uh, the song will reach people in a much better voice. And uh, fine, I mean, my job is over. But uh, with my literary poetry, my umbilical cord never gets cut. I'll recite a very small poem. Mera angan kitna kushada kitna bada tha, jisme mere sare khel samajate the, aur angan ke aage tha wo pyar ke jo mujhse kitna uncha tha. Lekin mujhko iska yakin tha jab main bada ho jaunga, is pyar ki phungi bhi chulunga. Barso baad main ghar lota hu, dekh raha hu. Ye angan kitna chota hai, pyar magar pehle se bhi thoda uncha hai.